Hey guys, what's up? This is Chaos Bender here again for you another video and welcome back to Mario Luigi Dream Team. In the previous episode, we got to the second area of Neo Bowser Castle and now after chasing Kamek to another Dream Portal, we are here and uh, before this intimidating looking door. Or intimidating looking door? I'm not, I'm not even sure if, if that is correct. Before we enter here, this door does look intimidating indeed and as you can tell I'm going to recover even though I didn't really have a lot to well recover because as you can tell I haven't really taken a lot of damage so with that let's enter this door and if I am not mistaken which I really okay yeah eh, there's something interesting going on over here so it's a classic just la uh, <laughs> lava is flowing upwards and you need to make haste towards the top and otherwise you're gonna get your ass burned anyway <laughs> so we continue over here and just a uh, quick question for you guys uh, have you you know enjoyed this let's play so far i know that you know maybe well this isn't really like uh complaining uh like that uh oh, how should I, I was about to just i didn't even know what i was gonna say <laughs> but are you enjoying this so far? I mean, this is not complaining wise. I, you know, I'm just, I am just stating that, you know, people don't really w w like to watch like the entire thing and I'm completely fine with that. Uh, me, sometimes I don't watch 100% of the videos. But are you enjoying this so far of what you are watching? I mean, maybe, you know, if you watch five minutes of it, you know, it's completely fine. But are you actually enjoying it? And if so, just, you know, just make sure to give me some feedback about it. It would be really good. So, we are over here, and uh, Mario Luigi! Yeah, but we're not gonna fall for it this time. What's wrong with me? It, it, it's me, Peach. I'm, I'm a damsel. Save me. <laughs> okay, I guess I wouldn't buy... Uh, I guess you wouldn't buy on that again. And second battle with Kamek. Let's do this. This is... Eh, you know, it's not all too difficult. It's not more difficult than the, than the previous time. Just these attacks that I really don't know. Uh, I don't know how to avoid these. I tr this is pure luck. This is pure luck. Like, I... Oh, and I get a power down. I don't even care. I'm gonna use a refreshing herb. This... I am not get I am not happy with the power down. It's gonna make the battle... Such... So longer. Uh, how do I... Uh, dude, how do I... How do I dodge this? How do I dodge this, man? How do I fucking dodge this? <sighs> On my main file, I just took the hits because I didn't even know what to do. Okay, thank you. I guess that works, at least. So, uh, down to 150 HP. Hopefully that is not too bad. He is the second one. And, uh, let me see. I believe uh, what we want to do is this right here. I am just not having the best of luck. Not even luck, this is cheap, man. So I'm going to use the Luigi-nary hammer. Uh, is that even going to be able to reach it? I don't even care. So it's the one on the far left, uh, far right. And hopefully this doesn't fail. Now, I don't have the power down from the attack that I cannot possibly dodge. If you guys have played this game, if you guys have beaten it, please let me know how, just how the hell do I dodge that, man. I guess that works, but it wasn't too good. Uh... Yeah, that kind of works. Uh, okay. Another power down. <sighs> Another power down, man. You know, I'm fine with defense down, speed down. But this... This I just don't get. This, uh, I'm just gonna take the hits and I'm gonna take refreshing herbs until this fucking dumbass decides not to do that fucking attack again. <sighs> I I don't even care at this point. I'm just gonna use my ref all my refreshing herbs. I have no clue how to dodge that attack. I have no clue how to dodge it. Okay, I guess it was... I don't give a fuck. I'm just going to attack this fucking dumbass. I am so pissed off right now. <sighs> Come on. I cannot dodge that attack for shit. I have no clue. I have no clue how it tells you, like, where it is going. I know that, well, it's a boss and whatever, but every single enemy on the Mario Luigi series, even the final boss, <sighs> even the final bosses of the game, like, kind of give you a hint of where they are heading with their attacks, but no. This, I have no clue how to avoid. 
And now that I see that my attack does not get diminished all that much, uh, I guess it's going to be okay. Hopefully, hopefully. I'm just going to take another hit. There, oh wow, thank you so much. Thank you so much, that happened. So, I guess we're going to have... Uh, not really going to trust the legionary hammer again. Uh, I'm just going to go for the flame. Now, the reason why I am, like, this angry at this battle is because, like, that attack, I have no clue how to avoid it. And even if I had a slight chance, even if it had to do with incredible reflexes, I would at least know where it is going, but no, I have no clue. I have no clue how to avoid it. 105 damage, that was incredibly weak. I'm not using that attack anymore. <sighs> this is quite tedious, man. This is quite tedious. Ah, uh, this attack again. This attack again. Yep. This is not gonna. This is just not happening. Uh, hammer and hopefully it gets the range. I really want to be done with this battle. This is. This is just breaking my ass right here. <sighs> Man. Sorry for all of this bullshit. Come on, please get it. Alright. How, how much damage? 344. I guess that's okay. Please, please die. Please die, dude. Not that... Not that attack. Okay, that's one. That's two. Okay. At least I dodged two of them. That's like a personal record for me. <laughs> Sorry that I'm just so bummed out, man. I mean, that... Just... Dodging two of them in a row, that kind of cheered me up a little bit, but this battle, dude. This battle and that attack in specific. Oh my god, it's so annoying. Please die, please die, dude. Come on. What is this, this attack? Oh, uh, this attack is really fun. Check it out. When he gets the dry bones, you want to st uh, stomp on as many as you can you might see you might notice that their attack isn't really doing all too uh, you know great and this is because you actually come on why just why can't i just do this this is because you actually need to stomp on as many as you can and i just i think i'm just gonna die in here i might just die in this one uh this is not looking good this is not looking good so stomp on this one stomp on this one as well uh, and we get this and depending on how many you got it's the equivalent of how many shots you have at doing this right here. So, let me see. We can get the... Uh, oh, my God. Please tell me I killed it. Please tell me I killed it. Oh, yes. Oh, it was looking bad. But we stuck on through. Stuck on through? Is that even... I'm not sure. Ah, oh, we did it. <laughs> Next time, it won't be so easy. And it's funny because the final phase of Kamek is actually the easiest one of all of them. And that's because... Well, you will see, but the attack that I cannot dodge for shit, it's not too... You know, it doesn't really make itself present in that battle, but I'm just going to hold that off for a bit, and you will have to see about that. But, maybe we can actually see that in this episode. We are 8 minutes, and we are already going to the final... Uh, is that the final area? Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure it is the final area. If not, it is the second to final area, but the, the true final area is actually pretty damn easy. So we get over here, go back to the dream world, and... I mean, to the real world, and it will be a really good time for Mario and Luigi, because now we got rid of the purple smoke, and we can travel through the second area more freely. More freely? I'm not, I'm not even sure. Alright, so Luigi wakes up. Now, <laughs> you know, I'm, I'm recording the same day that I recorded episodes 60 and 61, or no, 61 and 62, sorry. You gotta wait uh, quickly after him. But before you do that, you actually want to come over here. And by the way, this is really important. This is really important. When you get to this pipe, and you will see that the attack piece, I'm actually going to get that right now. You want to go to this pipe, and a shortcut is going to open for you to get to this area. So you, if you feel the need to go out, maybe buy some supplies or more or better equipment, 
you don't really need to walk all the way back and just avoid the deeper bombs that are just walking around or just bouncing around. And wow, I haven't I haven't even shown this enemy. Why <laughs> what was I thinking about? <laughs> anyway. This is I believe this is called a chain chump walker or something like that. I mean, kind of a weird name, but you know, their attacks aren't really all too difficult. And let me see, I'm just not gonna kill uh, I'm just not gonna kill them intentionally. If I kill one of them, I'm, I'm just going to hold off because I, yeah, I just want to show you their attacks, but I don't think I killed anything. That I, yeah, well, at least we have these right now. We're gonna max not, and with Luigi, I'm just gonna get rid of this dude in one, two, alright. And we will get to see how this dude attacks. So, you will see that that one is gonna go for Mario, and then you want to, uh, oh, wait, what? Oh, it also went for Mario, so never mind, you actually don't want to do that. Uh, so let me see, why should I... I'm just going to use a red shell, I believe that's going to be quite good. So, about the level ups, you actually want to get some experience increasing equipment, because if you do... I mean, it's not really crucial, like right now, I would be pretty well to fight the final boss, but if you are feeling too, uh, well, a, a little bit bad about your level, you definitely want to grab some experience increasing uh, items? Yes, items, sorry about that. <laughs> so you don't go into the battles maybe too under leveled, I'm not sure, and we didn't even I didn't even need to press anything for that. <laughs> so for this we get another max now, that's pretty good. So we get another 1k experience, almost well, getting to level 35, which only five more in order to get the rainbow rank, so that's pretty damn impressive. Uh, so, can't really get over here, can't get the attack piece yet, because we actually want to go, oh yeah, I, I just remember right now, but I guess it was a really good thing that I went to that room, so we got to see the last enemy, no, no uh, yeah, last enemy of New Bowser Castle, and I think I also, nah, yeah, never mind, you, uh, you also want to go to the left, and now this is what you need to do in order to get the next attack piece. So we are almost done with the attack pieces, this one is going to be number 8, and after that, well, the other two are incredibly easy to find, so you're really not going to have any trouble with that. Uh, so with this one, you're going to get to almost, and I believe there are also, no, never mind, this is not the room, but in another room, oh, wow, this is number 9? That's that's awesome, we got a golden statue, I believe that's worth, yeah, we, we've seen that before, that's worth 2,000 coins. But this one, however, the golden statue, I don't think I've shown this before. And I think it might be pretty good to equip this to, like, let me see, right here we have the coin gloves. Charge gloves, you will see the, 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 let me, where, where is it, where is it, there we go. Golden statue is going to increase most of our stats by 10. So, you know, so far this is better than the charge gloves. So I'm going to have this with Luigi until I go back and I have enough cash to sell maybe everything, not everything, but sell most of my stuff in order to get some of the, you know, best equipment that we can get at the Rainbow Tier store. Now, another thing that I was thinking about is that you don't need a whole ton of coins because when you get all of your expert challenges completed, as you can see here right now, let me see, where are they? Like, when you get to the gear, you get your expert boots, you also get your expert hammer, and you also get your expert wear. Believe it or not, the... These items, once you have full expert challenges, they are better than the top tier stuff that you can get at the Rainbow Rank store. So, I am not going to spend a whole ton in that because, oh, I guess we can take on this battle. No, never mind, I'll be right back. I just took some damage on purpose to make this go even faster because I am getting tired of the random encounters. Anyway, the one thing that I was saying is that you don't want to sell your expert wear because once you get full expert points, or expert challenge points, I should say, the stuff that you get from the expert challenges themselves, like the expert gear, that is going to be so much better than the top tier stuff that you can get in the rainbow rank shop, so just hold on to that. And you actually want to get the rest for the other brother that you, like for example, I think I'm actually going to focus on Mari because he has more more attack than Luigi, and Luigi is going to get the stuff that I can buy on the Rainbow Rank tier store, I don't really know what to say. So it will be kind of balanced, and I think that's going to be pretty damn good. So over here you want to come to this, well, not if you are, well, if you're going for the beans, yes, because there are two more beans in here that you want to get. 
and uh, that is it for that room <laughs> so the next one we have right here this is the uh, the next that you want to go to because it is the main one as you can see there is going to be Kamek but I believe uh, thing that we need to do for this puzzle, like right here, hi, you idiots, whatever. So, there is Antasma, he's going to open another dream world, uh, I mean, dream portal, and yeah, that's not gonna be fun. We could potentially go north, but I'm just gonna go to the other one because I don't really know if you could tell, but there is another ball or bomb uh, puzzle that we need in order to open the cage, and that I believe is going to be the final thing. So, well, the final dreamy area, so that would be... No, I think there's one more, but still, it's it, it's not that tedious. I can live with that. So we get over here, we get another secret box. These I really don't use and I don't care about, but they are worth, like, 150 coins at the store. So just, just get them and sell all of them, because it's going to be so great. Uh, am I doing anything wrong? Wow! I was actually doing this wrong. Uh, <laughs> you want to head back to the other, you know, to the other room where you found Kamek. And there you actually want to go to the north. I'll be right back. Okay, next time I need to open my menu. I'm just going to look at my gear. I have no clue why, but right now Luigi is, fa is faster than Mario. Which is actually pretty good. In no game have I been able to go with Luigi before Mario, so I guess that's kind of impressive. Okay, we are over here, so I guess that's good. Mm, kind of makes for full circle with this one, but, uh, you know, we, I guess we can scout over here. You know, it's going to be kind of the same area, but, you know, another one that we can really access before. And let me see, Luigi. Can I get this with Mario? That's pretty much it. Now, no more beans in here, but let me see. Can, can we get to a place that we couldn't really get to before? Mm, I'm not even sure. Come on. See, this is this very specific part, I don't remember too well, so why don't we go ahead and scout a little bit? I, I, I don't think it's going to be, you know, too bad for the progress. Uh, so we get to this door right here, and what this is going to do? Oh, yes, this is actually necessary. If, uh, then why is there another door? Hmm. Kind of mysterious. Anyway. There isn't really anything special over here other than those, uh, you know, this, uh... Well, item box right here that you can get, so I'm just going to show them to you. We're going to max handy. Those are incredibly useful, man. Just make sure not to use many of them because, well, you you might or might not need them for the final battle. I mean, it's... I guess it's a really nice bonus. Now, I think I'm actually going to get to this dream world that Kam uh, Kamek ran to, and I believe that's going to be it for this episode because, well, yeah, it's been going on for like 20 minutes or so. And come on, we get this place right here, and then we get over to this one with the use of the overpowered spin move. Uh, with this, we get another 100 coins, and, and now we make full circle over here in order to get to another uh, bomb puzzle. Now, this one, uh, let me see, I guess we need to do this right here, and then this. No, 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 this, you know, this needs to be like this. First, you want to uh, purposely make them cr uh, crash for you to get the items over here, and that will be kind of helpful. I mean, it's they aren't really too overpowered, but I guess it's something. So we got that, and now you want to turn this off, and the bomb is going to go on its way. And I believe that this is not done. Now, the, now we want to go to this room right here in order to complete this, and it will end up in the area that I went to first. So this isn't really all too bad. I mean, I really like this place. First of all, you, we will get this Kamek block right here, which is going to open the way to that place. I, I, I don't really know where that place takes us. Uh, I'm not really sure. Uh, why don't we f uh, find out, even though I think I'm... Uh, yeah, that was a very stupid mistake. <laughs> well, let me see. Where... Yeah, it's, it's just non-existent, but, you know, I guess it's okay because we can come back in here through this door. Now that we have the bombs in here, it is time to solve yet another one. I have a lot of enemies on my back right here, but I'm not going to do it right now. First, you want to... Let me see. Let me just check something really quick. First, you want to do that, and then it's going to open the door right here. So, after you do this, now you want to make the bombs go to the top row. And I believe it is done by doing this. And I am correct. There we go. 
And now on to the final area or the final like part to this puzzle right here is that we want to make the bombs land on another button that is going to open up the well the cage on the main room that we saw well before. <laughs> Now, before you do that, however, you want to let me see. You want to make the bombs land on the top uh, row. Maybe not the top row, but you know this top right here. And now you're going to have access to the area that I went to first, where you're going to have two item boxes as well as two beans. That is obviously going to be really helpful for 100% completion. And that is about it before the dreamy world. I'm going to go back and get the the loots. So. Yeah, and maybe that's gonna be it for the episode. So uh, let me see. What did I? What did I want to do anyway? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry for that. <laughs> okay, so we do this right here, and I believe we want to. Yeah, we want to press this one right here. What I will do is this, and now the bombs are going to travel to the main room. But before I continue to that area, I'm just gonna go to the other one really quick, and I'm gonna show you what the loot is. Now let me see. Let me see. Uh, how did I? Oh, never mind. I, I need to go over to the other place. Uh, so sorry. But, you know, right here you got some more loot, so I guess it's okay. 1-Up Deluxe. Awesome. And now for the final thing. Just gonna go back to that main room that I'm talking about. And, uh, come on. I just wanna avoid the fire brother. Man, I mean, even though my commentary is kind of really, really focusing on the gameplay right now. And I don't have many stories to tell you guys. This... This I really like. I'm getting so, so, so far ahead with the progress that I've been having, you know, compared to the to the past episodes, where I had like 15 minute episodes and I was barely doing anything. But this one is, this, these videos are so progress filled, man. It's so great. And a plus, I'm really enjoying this game, so it's, you know, it's a plus. And for the last time, a thing that I'm going to do in this episode is just travel to this room right here and obviously collect the loots. The items I don't think are that impressive. I mean, it's just one of Deluxe and Max Herb Jar. But obviously the beans right here that I'm going to take care of on the post-game episode, which is going to be quite good. You guys are really going to enjoy that episode. It's going to be an interactive selection. Well, maybe not selection. It's going to be an interactive menu where you can choose a area that you want to learn the most efficient route for the beans. And it will be it will be really good. You will see that. But I the one thing that I'm most looking forward to is just spending all the beans, man. I, I really, really want to get to spend all the beans. It's so awesome when you get all of your stats so high just for the beans. That's really good. So last thing, just get the loots over here. Obviously you want to do this right now. And I believe no you you, you don't want to do this one. Uh, there we go. That is going to press a button, and I believe the last area, well, the last dream area of Neo Bowser Castle. However, at this point in time, I do believe it is a really good time to say that if you guys have watched until now, and if you enjoyed a like the comment, would be really appreciated. Watch again my social media down below for not to miss an episode again. Ah, and with any further ado, you guys have a great day. Take care of yourself, and until my next episode, when we go, well, when we enter this area or dream area of. Neo Bowser Castle. I will see you then.